All right, it's time to get a look at that forecast for you. Meteorologist VNA Arana in right now. And VNA, how is it shaping up for us today? You know, it's going to be a really dry, hot day for the interior valleys, which is going to bring some concern for elevated fire danger. The reason we're under a microclimate weather alert is also because of the spare the air alert that was extended through today from the Bay Area Air Quality Management District. 76 degrees right now. Still have some lingering fog and clouds around San Francisco. 61 degrees right now. So let's take a look at how the rest of our day is going to shape out. These are your headlines for today. Spare the air alert. Valleys are going to be in the 90s and triple digits. And we're talking about fire danger in inland areas, especially later this afternoon. So let me guide you through what we're expecting to see, not just today, but the remainder of the week ahead as well. So there's an air quality advisor for the North Bay and the South Bay. You could see so far the AQI index scale shows it as moderate, but when you look at Santa Clara Valley, still unhealthy above that 100 mark, especially for sensitive groups for today. We had a little bit more of that smoke mixing in, but also this high pressure plays a role in this as well. Now we're already at 88 degrees in Fairfield and in through Livermore, 86 degrees, and that's not our peak heat. Our temperature change in the next couple hours is expected to boost up into the triple digits, but that also means that our temperatures are going to boost up and our humidity is going to go down because of that high pressure. Fairfield, 21% humidity right now. In through Livermore, 21%. And even in areas like Morgan Hill, if you look down through San Martin, also in those low 20s and 30s. Now, ideally, you want to be above the 40% mark when it comes to humidity that lessens the chance of some fire danger, but then we're going to bring in the wind gusts, especially between two and five o'clock. We start to see breezy conditions, 15 to 20 miles per hour, right through this area where conditions are really dry already. Concord, 16 miles per hour, Livermore, 19 miles per hour, even down through the South Bay, but look at Santa Rosa, 20 plus mile per hour winds. These are going to taper off into the overnight hours and into Wednesday, but your forecasted highs, it's going to get pretty hot. Look at this, 101 three in Concord, Antioch 104, Livermore 103. And a quick reminder that we remain under the exceptional category for this drought monitor. So if you're thinking, oh, well, why is it so bad that it's dry? Look how much dry brush we have. We are under the worst category in terms of the drought monitor. And over the next seven days, I wish I could say we were getting rain, but that's not going to happen. What might happen, though, is a little bit of cooling thanks to a system that's going to pass just to our east, mainly bringing a chance for some high High clouds out times and a little bit of a break from the triple digits back down into the 60s for San Francisco. So everyone, please be careful out there. I'll send it back to you.